So the first day that this case came out, it was a Monday. Okay. Uh, got the Amber Alert in the morning. Early afternoon, it was canceled. It was like, cool. You know, I just, just I think like other people probably assumed that they had found, you know, what the Amber Alert was called for. And then as I get home later that night, we were doing a show. And we started off the show with an update on that because uh, somebody in the chat had just mentioned uh, when we were doing our intro that, you know, about that case. So I went ahead and uh, covered that real quick at the beginning of the episode that Monday. And the next day, you know, as these... As this stuff started coming out Monday night and then Tuesday morning, okay, I was like, wow, we got to talk about this because it just reminded me, it reminded me of like Stephen Smith, which I have a, there's a dedication to that case that I had for Stephen Smith and I still do, always will. Uh, just because of how everything was so messed up. And so I spent so much time and researching and, and just covering it so much. And this, it gives me, it gave me the same vibe right off the bat. Uh, and then as we start to see over the, the next day or two about everything that was taking place, uh, you know, the press conference, how everything was taking place, uh the background of that individual and we're just like this so in my mind i'm like okay there this is like way deeper way deeper than anybody can imagine uh this is and when it comes to how deep it is initially i was like how why would ellie react this way Right. But then as I started to brain stew some more and I'm thinking and I'm like, what makes sense? And then I started doing some research for the area there in the beginning. And as I was doing my research, I started noticing other huge things popping up and I'm like, that would be the reason why shit went down the way that it did. Because without going in, uh, without one, uh, how do I say this? Without one part, which most people would assume is connected to it, without one part, didn't make sense to me the way stuff went down but then when i started doing my research and then i started seeing this stuff and i started putting it together with the other stuff and then i'm like that's why this person that's why these people that's why this didn't happen that's why this didn't happen that's why that didn't happen that's why this is going down the way that it is and that's how it all makes sense to me but i can't you know, this is a speculation channel, and it always will be, because that's what we are on YouTube. We don't work for LV. We're not in on the inside of these cases. So, we really are all speculation. So, but you can only, you know, to keep that in respect, you can only go to a certain point. And these speculations that I feel from the beginning of why this is all like this, I have to respect that as well. And so that's why, like if you're, if anybody's on Twitch, uh, it's going to be a Twitch only sub only, because I'm going to be honest with you. If I had a members only, if I, if YouTube allowed me to have memberships, unfortunately I can't, I'm only 400 and something. If YouTube allowed me to have memberships, then we'd be doing this members-only stuff. But the only way that I can do a members-only until I hit a thousand subs is to do it on Twitch. 
And so that's why I'm trying to get people together to uh, get on Twitch. If you have Amazon Prime, it's a free sub to me, and that'll get you the free sub. It's going to be a sub-only show. It's not something that's going to be uh, on past broadcast or nothing like that. Um, so I will do my way beyond speculations on that. I wish I could, like, seriously, I like you guys support me so much and you guys mean so much to me and, and the hard work that everybody does to help make the show what it is. I really wish that YouTube didn't have a requirement, whatever about the super stickers, right? I just wish YouTube didn't have a requirement where you had to be at a thousand subs to be able to offer memberships because I feel like everybody deserves it. And I wish I could do members only streams. 